So yeah, anyway, suspension. Let me show you suspension. I'm 95 kg, remember? Let me just check that's just, we'll tighten that. I'm 95 kg. Suspension, here it is, love it. Love the suspension, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, love the suspension. It's one of the best parts about it. I don't know how strong it is. Um, I always thought to myself, right, I'm gonna be heavy, if I'm gonna be coming off jumps, but the suspension is all right. Like literally, I feel like I could do a jump with it. You know what I'm saying? Like bunny hop, and I do quite regularly do a jump with it. So what I'm trying to say to you is, suspension's all right, lad. Do you know what I mean? So when I'm jumping off curbs, it's calm. Just jump off a curb. It's nice. I, again, I'm 95 kg. I was worried about it being a little bit too flimsy suspension-wise. No, no, it's not. Let me quickly go on to how you fold this down. The good thing about this one, like you can get those bigger scooters more powerful, yeah? Or let me say the more powerful scooters, but they're normally bigger, heavier, and of course more expensive. They can be better quality. Like my boy's got the Wolf Warrior 11. Six scooter, decent for off-road, goes 51 miles per hour. He's got 51 miles per hour out of it. Love it. That cost 2,600 pounds. This cost 880 pounds. Now, he can't, he can fold his down, don't get me wrong but it's like this long and that, and it weighs like 50 kg. Now, unless you're like deadlifter and that, you know what I mean, that's, that's long for men. So literally, this weighs 30 kg. It's not the lightest, but to literally fold this up, you have a twisting here, twist that up, and that releases it a bit, and allows you to take out the latching element, and then fold it down like that. Literally, obviously it's got a stand, and the stand's pretty damn strong, which I, oh, well, I, gonna, <laughs> I won't try it out, but I was standing on it before. But yeah, so it folds like that. Bend my legs, 30 kg, but I wouldn't say light work, no way, but I can do it, innit? So if you're happy with that, and then obviously, put that back up, twist that closer. There's like a metal bracket with the slots in there. You tighten it hand tight. Obviously it comes with two lights, pretty bright, and then it comes with sort of like an LED, well, a light here, a light there, both white lights, clear lights, and then a red light there, a red light there at the back. So chilling, so you can, you know, I can put them on, but you're not gonna see them that well. But like literally, you're lit up, do you know what I mean? You're lit up as you're going. So that's that in that respect. So yeah, and don't forget man, like if there's people thinking, Man, you must present this properly. Remember, I'm not a presenter. I'm not a YouTuber. I'm just trying to share the knowledge that I've got so people who are looking to buy one can get a little bit more of an insight from something, someone that's speaking English because, like I said, fair play to the Polish brothers and that, but I couldn't understand what they were saying. And it, although it looked good, I had no idea what they were saying. So hopefully, obviously, you man can understand me, even though I do speak a little bit slang. I can put on my um, proper British etiquette or English etiquette or language or accent or I don't know what I'm saying, do you know what I mean? That's why I've got to go back to being natural, being myself. So yeah, I'm going to quick, so yeah, that's the suspension thing. The suspension thing is all right, isn't it? So what should I, this pole, I've heard people say, now I've seen a video where someone has snapped this pole yet. I'm not seeing actually doing it, but I think it was, I think it was the wrong way guy or something like that and I know it seems like I'm plugging him but I don't care you know I'm here to help out everyone so literally he did one and he was doing loads of jumps though in the video and he came home and it was snapped and I was worried about that and then I saw hardly any anyone else posting anything about this being snapped so I thought it's got to be quite hard and you know what again I'm gonna go to my way I'm 95 kg do I feel like I'm ever gonna snap this in terms of the bar no do I think it is possible for me to snap it? I'm literally going to do a bit on suspension. You know, another thing, I ain't had a time to do my review again, my full review. So I'm just going to do a partial one on suspension. Make sure I'm review. So partial review on suspension.
sorry to keep handing. But yeah, like I said, I said sorry to keep hanging. Like I said, 95 kg and the suspension deals with my weight perfectly. Perfect. Perfect. So yeah, 95 kg, just watch the suspension. Like I said, this is just a very quick review on the suspension. People don't know what it's like. People don't know what it's like for heavier people. I would say 95 kg, no disrespect to everyone, but that sort of covers the heavier people. No issues whatsoever. Still can hit 31 miles per hour at 95 kg. Come on, jump off curbs, do wheelies, do jumps, and it costs 880 pounds. 880 pounds bought from the UK. I can go to work on this. Come on, five miles to work, five miles back, and a little play. And it'll move from five bar battery down to three bar battery. It's a no brainer for me, but obviously, do your research. Look online, there's others to get. I think this is one of the best. Let me know if you think something else is better. Simple as that, let me know or let the other people know. It's all the education thing out here. Like I'm doing this because I would appreciate having a English review when I was out shopping around, but there wasn't any out there. And like I said, this isn't the full review. The full review is coming on my page. Just subscribe and hit the notifications and you'll get an instant notification when I release it. It's gonna be soon. Like I said, Marcus Boost, if you wanna know any questions or any answers to any questions, obviously I'm not an expert on this. This is my only electric scooter, Kugu G Booster, but I love it. Like I paid 880 pounds and I think it was worth it. My boy's got one, 2,600 pounds, Kabu Wolf Warrior 11. Has he wasted his money paying 2,600? No way, because that thing is militant. Uh, that's why I'm comparing this to that. It's never going to happen, but at the end of the day, for the price you pay, it's decent. Quality's decent. Battery life, decent. Easy to use, decent. There yeah, are good bits, uh, also a little bit of bad bits, but I'll let you know what that situation is, yeah? I'll let you know what that situation is with the good bits and the bad bits. Just subscribe, watch my videos. But for now, I'm just going to show you a little bit more about the suspension, how it takes my weight nicely. here yeah so i've got it on gear three it's four bars of battery four bars out of bat out of five it's at 50.1 volts as far as i'm aware it's pretty good watch how it goes so obviously i just want to oh just easy
we've got lights. Go and watch how my lights look when they're coming because I haven't got them straightened properly. But yeah, you can see the lights all over, so it should be visible. And listen, people, trust me, I'm normally wearing a helmet. I just didn't bring a helmet with me this time because I was only going to be going to the field, literally right by me. But all of a sudden, I ended up here and I thought I'd just do this opportunity to give you a quick video. That's your suspension review. Just to put things into perspective, I've most probably been riding. I rode for the fields for about 20 minutes and just been messing about up and down here, going around. And I'm still on four out of five bars using my lights now, so we'll use up more battery. But I have no issue with thinking I'm not going to be able to get home from here. Obviously, I use cycle paths all the way here because I'm lucky enough to be able to do that. Um, so I don't have to go on the road or anything like that, and it's all lit up. so. For me at the moment it's all good but obviously getting dark now just be careful when you ride it but yeah literally that is it on suspension like i said like if you like it subscribe and get your notifications if you want to see more videos on the kugu g booster so yeah that's it for you